Okay. So here we are, right? Now yeah. I want to click on the Google Chrome extension, right? I want to sign in there. That's right. Okay, right. cool. So go to Google Maps now. Okay. You're signed in. You're good. Google Maps. Yeah. So instead of being in the streets looking for homes, you can actually look for homes on Google Maps or pay somebody like 4 or $5 an hour to look for homes on Google Maps for you. <laughs> okay. Now, it's out of date about um, up to a year sometimes. So okay. obviously this doesn't replace like being in the streets and seeing those homes in person. But I wanted to show you how to do this as like a secondary option to get those leads coming in for you. And this is basically like virtual wholesaling. What what I'm being what I'm doing right now, right? Like not vir virtual driving for dollars. Virtual driving for dollars. Sweet. I appreciate you coming by, David. Yeah, okay, so cool. The way that you do it is you drop that little yellow man down there. Get the little yellow street, man. Drop him onto a street. Oh wow. Go <laughs> take a look at this actually. Look at this little yellow guy. If I swing him left and right, he's like flying all over the place. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna drop him on the street. Boom. Mm -hmm. Now you wanna just keep going till you see something run down. Okay. Some of these are nice. Let's keep going. That's kinda old looking. Yeah, let's do this one. All right. You see in the top left where it says 246 Gettysburg? Yes. You click the little pin. This little pin thing? Right. Okay. Boom. Okay. And now go to that Chrome extension. Right here? Open. Yeah. And click add to list. Got it. Success. Yeah. So now if you go into your deal machine account, this address is in your account, looked up the owner, and it's ready to send mail to export. <laughs> Oh, wow, dude, that's actually really cool. Okay, so what did we do the last time? Owner last occupied. Time we, skip trace some we did, we're gonna do that again. If I get lucky again on camera, I swear. David, we're going to Vegas. <laughs> we got one phone number. We got a phone number. Okay, good, now let's call this guy. This is the best thing about Deal Machine, guys. Like, ultimately, it's on the spot, it's hands-on. Like, what I love so much about Deal Machine is that I can pull out my phone and then literally just pop in the address to a house that's in front of me. And there's so many different marketing tactics that I can utilize that are already built into the app. So if I click on Enhanced Search inside of the app, it's gonna allow me to skip trace the lead, which is amazing. However, if I click on Send Mailers, I can begin a direct mail campaign and I'll send letters until I decide to stop. And how often does it send the letter? You can set it, but default is 21 days. Default. So every, every 21, 21 days. days, I'll send a postcard. Yeah. It's good when you, so a lot of people, they give up after they send one postcard, and that's how you know you're not doing it right. Everybody knows that you close the deal on the seventh postcard that you send. So for all my guys out there that are doing direct mail, that's definitely something that you want to do. So guys, look, check this out. So you're, you're here, when, when you put the information in the deal machine, you're able to see a couple of things. You see that the owner right here is 48 years old, right? So... He's already kind of old timer. Not only that, but this is an owner occupied property. So he's living in the house. And just by clicking on enhanced search, guys, I can do so much. Now, I know that I, I drove for dollars on the map, David. Um, can I put a photo of the front of that house from Google Maps onto this letter? Or do I have to physically take the photo still? You can't. There's actually a feature we have called Street Pick. That'll oh, cool. That'll automatically do that for you. How do we do that? You know what? Just click that camera on the top right. Okay. Boom. Get from Street Pick. Add to your subscription. It is an add-on, but you should have it as part of your enterprise. Thing. Okay, cool, cool. So I am an M enterprise member. Uh, may just not be working right now, but that is awesome. So I would just click on options, and then I would add that, correct? And then right. now I have the front of the house. It'll do that for all your deals. So you guys have 10,000 deals in there. A lot of them don't have that picture. Mm -hmm. So that I'll make sure it should be on your enterprise account to be able to do that. But that's how it works. So you get all of those fulfilled for you. The reason why you want to send a, a postcard with the front of their property on the address is because if I saw a postcard that had the front of my house on it, I'm going to be more obligated to call this person because they were outside of my home. Some people may think it's a bad tactic. I think it is good and it's going to increase the success rate on the letter that you send out because ultimately you want to get them on the phone because that's how you're going to close them, okay? You don't close them on the postcard. Sometimes you can get lucky and that works, but you're going to close them on the phone. So that's amazing. So we just clicked enhance search on the spot yeah. on a deal that I just found driving for dollars using the Google Maps app with a plugin that had deal machine on it. 
Can I show you a couple mail pieces that actually are optimized for when you don't have a photo? Sure, let's do it. Let's All do right. it. So go ahead to outreach campaign and click options. Outreach campaign, where is that? Uh, it's actually this block right here with the mail. Okay, click on options. Yep, and so select a template. Template right here. Create new? Yeah, create a new template in there. Okay. Continue. Yeah. Four by four postcard. Oh, yeah, so wow. We've got a few there. And so the one that says handwritten font, that's going to be one that lets you send something that looks good even when you don't have a photo. Now, these things that are that are like kind of sticking out where it says address and then signature name, right. I'm guessing it's mapping their information to the postcard. Yeah, and if you click in there, you can actually see some of the mapping options. Oh, so this is how you customize your direct mail. Like this is very simplified because now I can add my own spin on it. So Deal Machine does have its own default templates for you. But guys, if you want to give your direct mail that personal touch, this is something that you're going to want to utilize right off of the bat. I mean, dude, uh, I like the message. I think it's very straightforward. Sometimes it could also come off very rough, right? So you have to add something. Like for example, the common message that people say is, hi, my name is so-and-so. I wanna buy your property at 123 Main Street. If you're interested, please give me a call. I want you guys to think about this approach because this one is a kicker. So for all my people putting out direct mail, this one's gonna be the differential factor in how you become successful in direct mail. We used to do direct mail for like three years straight. That was the beginning of my business. So try this. Hello, Mr. Seller. Hope you're well. You're starting it out nice now, okay? I hope you're well. Check this out. My name is Quentin. You don't want to say that you work for this so-and-so company. You want to say, me and my brother, me and my sister, me and my mom, my granddad, or whoever you want, insert that there, are driving in your neighborhood and we, we looked at your home and we think that it's beautiful. I'd love to make you an offer on that property. If by chance you would be interested in hearing us out, it's non-obligation. So give me a call. I'd look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. And then add it with this. It's very important. God bless you. And then there you go. That's all you got to do. With this type of touch, your conversion rate's going to go straight to the roof. And that's more personalized because now it feels like I'm talking to you. It's just like a YouTube video. Think about Gary Vaynerchuk for a second, right? Right? Like, and when you look at his YouTube videos, I know they're going to come out every single day. So it's never a point for me to watch this. Could you imagine how many postcards a motivated seller gets? You have to figure out a way to stand out. I come out with one to two YouTube videos every single month. So if you're watching this right now, you're going to have to wait another 30 days before you see my next one. The reason why I do that, guys, is because when I do my videos, I'm speaking to you. I'm talking to you on the other side of that camera, okay? So remember that. Add a personal touch and I guarantee you guys you're gonna get direct mail successful in no time okay so remember that Man, so this is beautiful you're good with words <laughs> thank you <laughs> it's a gift man my grandpa used to tell me crazy stories save it yeah save button, okay so right. save it save it on the right okay right there, yeah this Bottom, thing create new template. okay perfect boom <clears throat> So there we go, you know? Yes, now under your mailing options, you should have a new template to select. It's on the default now, but you could use template two. You can Boom. name it later, just click. And update. then just click, click update, mm -hmm. bada bing, bada boom. So that was fire, that was fire. So now we have an updated template. It's about to send out template number two to our seller. And uh, is this your property? Not only that, but you can view it and get an idea of what it looks like. And I can add the image of the house, right? If I wanted to. Yeah, this one doesn't include the image. Okay. All the other templates have a spot for an image. So I like this, this though. This is the one that you want to use if you don't if you don't have an image. This is awesome either way. I like this because it's more personal, especially when you add that verbiage, your conversion rate is just going to be tremendously higher. So remember that, guys. So uh, we just got done enhancing it. I want to cold call it. Um, maybe let's see. Let's let's try it right now. Hopefully, we're able to get a hold of this person. Jose. Jose Cuervo. Okay. Two, one. Here we go. We're going to call this guy. And I got an iPhone now. No more green bubble. No, I didn't. Either way. No, and that, that's completely fine, guys. This is a numbers game. You never expect to get the first skip trace right. It's always the third or the fourth. I guarantee it. Um, so, I mean, what that means is that we just got to either do deeper skip tracing on it or just send a letter, you know, like right now I can send a letter if I wanted to. So I'm just going to go for it and click on start mailers. I think this is a good deal. So what we're going to do is approve the address 
and then bada bing bada boom David with his team on the back end are going to start kicking out this letter for me printing it out and it's going to be delivered every 21 days so guys um David dude thank you so much for coming by Bro. and showing me the stuff again again wow. So guys, remember, use promo code Ground Zero, all right? And uh, download the Deal Machine app. This stuff is fire. We've used it in our company. We use it to stack it against other data. I'll probably come out with more videos on how you can maximize this software. Because I think I'm at this point, I'm thinking of things that maybe David have not even thought of. I'm sure you have. <laughs> You've added 10,000 properties. Yeah. Your team's out there adding properties. We're doing all kinds yeah. of stuff. So maybe I'll even do like a, a video about how we, how we do our Driving for Dollars campaigns. Absolutely. So I'll see you guys on the next Deal Machine video. Thank y'all so much for tuning in.